Thailand went to the polls yesterday to cast their votes in the general election. As the results stand, Poor Thai and Palam Pracharat are the two most successful parties in this election, and both are striving to try and form a coalition government on their own. The BJT or the Boom Jai Thai Party is likely to play the role of kingmaker to decide which coalition actually gets to form the government. Here are three key takeaways from, the, from this election. The first is that Prayut is going to come back as Prime Minister. He has the votes from the Senate and likely from some of the par parties in the lower house in order to be able to come back as Prime Minister. And this will make the military's plan to control the next government much easier. The second is that a pro-military party and coalition are likely to be able to form the government, but this will likely be a minority government, which means in practical terms, this government is going to find it very challenging to pass legislation without the help of the opposition parties. The third key takeaway is the potential for unrest in the streets, especially in Bangkok in the coming days and weeks, really driven by perceptions that the election commission has been unwilling or unable to address irregularities that have cropped up in voting, and particularly irregularities that appear to have advantaged the Palam Patriot Party.